What's going on everybody? Welcome to the channel. Today's footage is just a compilation of about four days of diving out here in Florida. As you can see, ocean's that way right there. Uh, first day of diving was we were running out offshore and uh, we actually came upon humpback whale. And uh, we were in about 600 feet of water, so it, it dove down before we got anywhere close to it. So uh, we weren't able to get any footage with it, but it was still really cool to see. Um, and then once we got about a quarter, quarter mile offshore in Deerfield, we jumped in, put the tanks on, and uh, we saw nothing, anything too cool, but you know, we saw some cool puffer fish. Uh, that puffer fish is actually poison enough to kill about 30 people. Uh, so we'll let that footage roll. Just found a whale straight out there. We're heading to it. We're gonna creep up pretty slow. We're gonna get in the water. I can't wait. Fins are in. So something I actually forgot to mention was one of the members of our dive team actually forgot to connect his uh, his pressure hose to his BCD and inflate it before he threw it in the water to put it on inside the water. And uh, as you could probably guess, with the weights and the, the tank weight, it sunk 40 feet down. I had to dive down, fully inflate my vest, and uh, swim back to the surface. So here's that footage right now. So now this is footage from day two. Uh, we went spear fishing off of Rapa Nui. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but I think so. Rapa Nui Rock Ledge in Deerfield. Um, didn't see anything too big. We saw some yellowtail snapper, some uh, lionfish. Wasn't able to successfully land on anything, but uh, I'd rather be selective and know I'm shooting something ethical as opposed to shooting everything I see. So uh, we'll let that footage roll and then we'll get on to it with day three. So this is footage from day three. The visibility was actually beyond awful. Me and my dive partner lost each other plenty of times because there was about three foot of viz. But we saw some really cool starfish, some pretty cool fish, some crabs, uh, nothing huge. The visibility, like I said, was so bad. We couldn't really find out where we were or what we were doing. It was only about 13 feet of water. Um, the area we were in was like the number one uh, crime city in Florida. So we didn't want to leave the car alone for too long. But um, yeah, so this is footage from day three.
So now this is the footage from day four. This is actually my favorite day of diving so far. We're down in Key Largo with a Rainbow Reef uh, diving charter. And we went to the French Reef system. We, the first dive was a uh, Christmas Tree Cove. And we sw swam through some really, really cool uh, underwater tunnels. Saw a Hawksbill turtle, and plenty of other fish. And then the second dive of that day, we moved over to, um, it was called the Turtle's Ledge in the French Reef system as well. And that's where a lot of more pelagic fish hang out. Um, we were told that uh, hammerheads are in that area during this time of the year, but we didn't end up seeing any. We saw uh, another hawksbill turtle feeding that I got super close to, it was really cool. And then we saw a huge old looking loggerhead turtle that let me get really close to it, which I was stoked about. So this is day's four footage.
So this is actually the end of the video. If you guys like to subscribe and give me a like, please. Uh, I definitely plan on filming more of the adventure stuff. I love doing adventures. I love being in nature. And uh, I definitely plan on doing a ton more diving, fishing, camping, and stuff like that. So if you like it, subscribe and be uh, on the lookout for more footage.